So we're in Warsaw, at the square of the heroes of the Warsaw Ghetto. This was the very northern part of the Ghetto district in the Muranov district of Warsaw. This is the part of the ghetto which in 1943 becomes the witness of the Warsaw Ghetto Uprising which started on the 19th of April and continued up until the night of the 8th and the 9th of May. Right after the war, this part of Warsaw was an ocean of rubbles because the German Nazis and various auxiliary military units which were called into Warsaw in April of 1943 to very brutally ascend against the uprisers were using the tactics of going building by building and destroying structure after structure and in this way limiting the zone of operation of the uprisers. Obviously Las Banca was the last bunker of the Jewish fighting organization on Mila 18, which is literally a block away from here, and uh, this one was assaulted by the German Nazis on the 8th and the 9th of May of 1943, which marks the end of the Warsaw Ghetto Uprising. After the war, this district was nothing else but the ocean of rubbles. And right after the war finished, in 1947, this monument, which is actually featuring the Warsaw Uprises and Bartihan Yalevich, was established. It was designed by Nathan Rappaport, and it was dominating as the only structure standing within this ocean of rubbles that the German Nazis left after the brutal liquidation of the Warsaw Ghetto and the Warsaw Ghetto Uprises. This square was staying empty for decades after the war and only recently it was constructed over with this magnificent building of the Museum of History of Polish Jews, Pauline, which focuses on telling the story of 10 centuries of Polish Jewry.